Dreamland. By Edgar Allan Poe. By a route obscure and lonely, haunted by ill angels only, where and but newly from an ultimate Eidolon named Night. On a black throne reigns upright. I have reached these lands, dim Thule, from a wild clime that lieth sublime, out of space, out of time. Bottomless vales and boundless floods, and chasms and caves and titan woods, with forms that no man can discover, for the tears that drip all over. Mountains toppling evermore, into seas without a shore, seas with restless aspire, surging unto skies of fire, lakes with endless outspread, their lonely waters, lonely and dead. There are still waters, still and chilly, with the snows of the lonely lily. By the lakes that thus outspread their lone waters, lone and dead. Their sad waters, sad and chilly, with the snows of the lonely lily. By the mountains near the river, murmuring lowly, murmuring ever. By the gray woods, by the swamp, where the toad and the newton camp. By the dismal tarns and pools, where dwell the ghouls. By each spot the most unholy, in each nook most melancholy. There the traveler meets aghast, sheeted memories of the past. Shrouded forms that start and sigh as they pass the wanderer by. White-robed forms of friends long given, in agony to the earth and heaven. For the heart whose woes are legion, tis a peaceful, soothing region. For the spirit that walks in shadow, Tis, oh, tis El Dorado. But the traveler traveling through it may not dare openly view it. Never its mysteries are exposed to the weak human eye unclosed. To the weak human eye unclosed, so wills its king, who hath forbid the uplifting of its fridged lid. And thus the sad soul that hears pressed beholds it, but through darkened glasses. By a route obscure and lonely, haunted by ill angels only, where an eidolon named Night on a black throne reigns upright. I have wandered home, but newly, from this ultimate dim thew.